So you're thinking about moving to San Anselmo, California. Well, today we're gonna to explore the town of San Anselmo, but we're not just gonna talk about the good stuff. We're gonna dig into what may have you think twice about making the move here. We'll take an in-depth look at the pros and cons of living in this charming community nestled in Marin County. So if you're potentially considering a move to this area, you're in the right place. Let's dig in right now. First up, let's talk about the pros and the reasons to call San Anselmo home. San Anselmo is truly a place of scenic beauty. The town is cocooned by lush rolling hills and it offers stunning views of the iconic Mount Tamalpais. The landscape here is something out of a dream. Just imagine enjoying a cup of coffee on your porch while checking the breathtaking sunset over Mount Tam. It's a daily spectacle that never gets old. San Anselmo Creek also flows through the town, adding to its natural charm and providing a peaceful environment for residents. And many residents take pride in maintaining colorful gardens and well-manicured landscapes, contributing to the town's overall beauty. The area offers a network of scenic biking routes, allowing residents to explore the special countryside while staying active. In fact, the scenic surroundings have inspired numerous artists who call San Anselmo home. The town has a thriving art community with many artists showcasing their work in, in local galleries. But it's not just the natural beauty that sets San Anselmo apart. The town is a charming and historic downtown. It's a place where the past and present seamlessly blend. Strolling through these quaint streets, you'll discover unique boutiques. The downtown area is dotted with charming cafes and restaurants. Ensaladas offers an excellent Mediterranean fine dining experience, while Marinitas on Sir Francis Drake is one of our go-to Mexican restaurants and a San Anselmo staple. Many buildings in the area have retained their historic charm and the architecture reflects the town's rich heritage. Downtown San Anselmo is not just a place to shop and dine, it's also the heart of the community, hosting events like the holiday lighting ceremony in Imagination Park, Breakfast with Santa, the Goblins Spooktacular, where kids dress up for Halloween and trick or treat. I should mention that if this is your first time on the channel and you wanna know everything there is about living inside of Marin County, California, then you can subscribe below, tap the bell for notifications so you can be the first to learn about the current market here in Marin. My name is Tyler and I get calls every day from people just like you looking to make the smooth move to Marin and I absolutely love it. So whether you're looking to make the move in a week or three months, just give me a call, shoot me a text or email or schedule a Zoom. All information is in the description below and I'm happy to help you make that move to Marin. Another major advantage of living in San Anselmo is the top-notch education. If you have kids or are planning to, you'll be pleased to know that San Anselmo is home to some fantastic schools. Archie Williams High School consistently ranks high in state and national education rankings, and the Wade Thomas Elementary School is highly regarded for its strong academic programs. San Domenico School offers a well-rounded private education with a special focus on arts and sciences. And the town in general is also committed to education with initiatives like adopt a school that encourages community involvement in local schools. But it's not just about work and education. San Anselmo has a vibrant community spirit that's nurtured through a variety of events throughout the year, bringing residents together in celebration. Along with the events I previously mentioned, San Anselmo hosts the San Anselmo Live on the Avenue music series all summer long, which feels quasi-European with the summer air, closed streets, redwood trees, and live music, creating a true sense of community that brings neighbors together. The town actively promotes civic engagement and volunteerism as well. Events like community cleanup days give residents a chance to make a positive in impact on the surroundings. And San Anselmo is known for its charitable events as well, such as charity runs and fundraisers where locals come together to support meaningful causes. And pro tip number five is San Anselmo's outdoor recreation. It's a paradise for those who love the outdoors with ample opportunities to connect with nature a Marin favorite park, and probably one of our favorite parks to bring our three-year-old to is Memorial Park. It's San Anselmo's most developed park and has several sports fields, grassy areas, tennis courts, outdoor facilities, and a really special children's playground. The town itself boasts multiple trails and open spaces, including Sorge Park, Bald Hill Preserve, 
and many homes offer nice privacy with larger lots opening up to redwood areas and open space. And while San Anselmo offers many advantages, let's consider the challenges as well. Let's explore the potential drawbacks you might encounter when living here. Con number one is home prices and limited inventory. It's no secret that this charming town comes with a premium price tag. The median single family home price in San Anselmo in Q4 2023 was 1.54 million and $932 per square foot. And there's a fairly wide range of homes from starter home fixers at a little over 1 million to a state sitting on an acre upwards of 5 million. It can be a competitive real estate market due to all the pros I mentioned. As far as available inventory, there was an average of nine single family homes to hit the market each month of Q4 2023 which was certainly a down quarter inventory wise for San Anselmo standards. Um, but you can see why homes can get swooped up fairly quickly when they hit the market. Next, let's discuss traffic congestion. Like many areas in the Bay Area, San Anselmo can experience its fair share of traffic woes, particularly during peak hours. Since San Anselmo lies on the west side of Marin County, the primary route to and from is Sir Francis Drake. This is also where Archie Williams High School is and during commute times or school letting in and out, it has a tendency to back up causing congestion. This is one of the primary complaints my clients that have moved to the area have mentioned. It's best to leave an extra 10, 15 minutes uh, during these commute times, especially if you're trying to commute to the 101 to get to the city. Um, this is certainly high traffic times and, and can limit frustration if you're leaving a little bit earlier. Public transportation options do exist, uh, but they may not offer the same level of convenience as in larger cities, potentially leading to more residents relying on their personal vehicles. And during seasonal events and festivals, the influx of visitors can contribute to additional traffic congestion in the downtown area. It's pretty much 100% likely that you'll need your own car if you move to San Anselmo. And for that matter, most all of Marin. Unless you're near a downtown area that you either work remotely or you work downtown in that area. The next con is natural disaster risk. Living in Marin County means being prepared for potential natural disasters. While the region is undoubtedly beautiful, it's not immune to these risks. Marin County can be prone to wildfires and with fire insurance becoming more challenging to obtain, it's important to do your due diligence on the home before putting in an offer. Also, in low-lying areas, flooding can be a risk, particularly near San Anselmo Creek. I know during the heavy rains a few years ago, that was a challenge for the local businesses downtown and some residents near the creek. And finally, limited job opportunities. While San Anselmo is a wonderful place, job opportunities within the town itself may be limited. Many residents commute to nearby cities like San Francisco, Silicon Valley for work or the East Bay, which can result in longer daily commutes, particularly for those in specialized fields. The town's economy primarily revolves around retail services and small businesses, which may not offer the same range of career opportunities found in larger urban areas. And while San Francisco Bay Area is known for its tech industry, the majority of tech companies are located in nearby cities, necessitating a commute for those, for those in the tech sector. For those freelancers or remote workers, San Anselmo does offer co-working spaces, but those seeking employment within specific industries are likely going to need to explore opportunities beyond the town's borders. So there you have it, an in-depth look at the pros and cons of living in San Anselmo. And remember, every place has its strengths and challenges, of course, so it's essential to weigh them based on your lifestyle and your preferences. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button for more insights into the real estate market in Marin County. And thanks for watching. Until next time, I hope to see you around town.